Hey guys, Youngblood with you, and if you're like me, both times that the 64-bit uh, client came out, you were like, hot damn, this is great, the game doesn't crash, it runs smoother, I can use ultra settings with no problems and no stuttering, fantastic, hands up in the air, you're excited. And then very shortly after that, all of a sudden, the 64-bit client gets ripped out from underneath our feet because it's causing problems for somebody else. That's okay. I, I understand what they're doing, but it is frustrating because I crash like crazy on the 32-bit client, but as soon as I'm on the 64, it's like smooth as butter. Well, Pryon Bacon off of Reddit actually figured out how to go in and force the 64-bit client. So if you're one of the people like me that does better with the 64-bit client, I wanted to show you how to actually do this. And again, all credit goes to him. I'll post a link so you can go give him some uh, karma on Reddit. Um, but here's how you can actually go in and force it in case you guys are not Redditors. So I went ahead and included a screenshot so you can see that the stock game is running x86, which is the 32-bit uh, client. So what you need to do is go into your PlanetSide2 folder and rename PlanetSide2.exe to something else. I just added nope afterwards. Then what you're going to do is make a copy of the 64-bit client, um, basically going to copy and then paste it into, the, uh, into your folder, which is then going to just add copy. Then just rename the 64 one PlanetSide2. Take off the dash x64.exe. That's going to make it so that's the default one that's going to pull when you actually open up your PlanetSide. And now I've actually included a screenshot of me playing with this change, and you can see that it is verified that I am playing on the 64-bit client. It has been smooth as butter, just as we had hoped it would be. So, um, you know, try it out. If it works for you, great. Um, I'm not making any promises that this is okay or it's not going to be patched to work, or maybe we'll have 64-bit back in an hour. Who knows? But if you want to use it now, this is a way that you can do it. And who knows? Maybe it's a way that we can at least test it out for SOE. So there you go. Again, all credit goes to Pry on Bacon. Check the link for the description and go give him some thumbs up. Otherwise, I will talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Take care.